It is a Cleveland exclusive. Ramona, the only local anchor to get invited to sit down with the leader of the free world. So let's get right to it. Ramona joins us live from just outside the Capitol with more of her exclusive report. Hi, Ramona. Hi, Chris. Thank you so much. I am live in Washington. Had a great day today. I actually sat down with the president of the United States, Barack Obama, as you know, and we talked about a number of issues plaguing Northeast Ohio. We talked about gas prices, those surging gas prices, high unemployment, Cuyahoga County corruption, and Senate Bill 5, the collected bargaining bill. And he said while he understands the financial issues facing states, in Northeast Ohio, he says he doesn't feel like states should solve their problems on the backs of workers. On folks who are making a business investment. Let's make sure that we've got shared sacrifice, that uh, we make sure that the burden does, doesn't just fall on one set of folks. Let's certainly not blame public employees for a financial crisis that uh, they had nothing to do with. And let's not use this as an excuse uh, to erode their bargaining rights. And, and so, uh, you know, whether it's Wisconsin or what we're seeing in Ohio, uh, I strongly disapprove. And he also, Chris and Robin, talked about how Ohio's political landscape has changed since he was elected in 2008. And he says he wants Ohioans to give him four more years. He talks a lot about why he thinks he deserves four more years in office. I'm going to have more on that coming up tonight at 11. Hey, Ramona, everybody's talking about gas prices. What did uh, President Obama have to say about them? He had a lot to say, Robin, today about gas prices. Um, he admitted to me, though, there's no quick fix. Uh, as I sat there waiting to do my interview, he actually fired off a letter to Congress urging them to stop giving tax subsidies to oil and gas companies. He also said he's pushing for fuel efficient cars and he's really big on clean energy, as you might know. But again, he admitted that there is no silver bullet to bring these prices down quickly. Okay, Ramona, thanks very much. We'll see you a little bit later on tonight. Of course, we'll hear much more from her and from President Obama on Channel 3 News at 11, as she mentioned. And you can catch her exclusive interview as well on our website, wkyc.com.